No get down word. It's just all correct and right. Yes, I want to be lucky. Hi hey guys, my name is Anna. You are at my channel where I actually trade on boundary options on a Quadrex platform. I love the platform, I love the boundary options, and I love just invent and test some strategies for them and check if it's gonna be profitable or working for us today or just this time. Let's start. And here we are gonna start with the one minute interval and with this 322 as start and sum and here we are with the all candles it's going to be 10 seconds candles this time the first indicator is going to be indicator that's going to be located just right on chart and you may see that it's the dungeon channel and that's fine the period is seven yes and the second one going to be the cci and period is still seven so it's all just combined in that case the third one look at that 5 26 and 9 and the favorite one of mine macd so quite nice and easy strategy i would say again and again just because if you are observing the chart quite fast you know quite straight you can see what's actually going on right here we don't need any specific you know knowledges like i don't know heavy theories we can actually analyze it from the very very best from the very very first side so here we are let's start let's use that and let's make it profitable this time and here without any explanations without any i don't know even have you thinking this is actually quite quite perfectly visible we're gonna get downward and look at that just the chart at the peak and you may see already that the tendency just started cci showing us we're getting downward macd lines showing us it's gonna be crossing and this green line gonna be below the orange one and all the candles of the macd still showing us we're getting downward so just here we are Yeah, but I must say that actually that been the period that we've been getting downward, but we started to rise just a little bit. And yes, I want to be lucky this time because this is the first one. Otherwise, I'm just going to... I'm just gonna lo lose all this money and gonna start it again and tell you again and again this is gonna be the perfect strategy. No, it was just working out because we were actually correct about that tendency, but the tendency were a little bit shorter than we expected. And actually, you may see that this is just the downward, this is the falling, but just, you know, this like the steps, like a letter. And again, let's continue with these type of situations. I just want to see if it's going to be a little bit different just because, look at that. Yep, the indicators just changed. And CCI showing us we're getting downward, but we are a little bit like at the bottom. And look at the candles of the MACD. It is orange, but above zero, started to get below zero. And the crossing just started. So we are detecting that the crossing already already happened and we just getting downward and look at the dungeon channel just a little bit forgot about that but anyway you may see this is just the narrow part of it and it's getting wider so we do be, we do predict it's going to be the changing of the trend and here actually like 15 seconds left um now i'm going to skip all of that and in that case and this time this is just a clear profit yep don't i don't need that <laughs> green ones no get downward get downward but cci already reached the bottom so this is actually the perfect perfect indicator right here because macd is correct and right and you may see that the candle started to change but it would actually give you um quick quick thought that it may be not that long this is the position of the cci yeah it's getting downward but it's actually if it is located already in the middle or getting you know closer to the bottom so we do expect yeah, the, there are some chances that it's going to be the breaking back. And different situation, different prognosis. And here we are. Look at the downturn channel. It's wide. So we have, yeah, we have just the change of the tendency in that case. Look at the MACD green line just above the orange one at the candles built above zero and it's green. 
and CCI. So here just the CCI is kind of indicator that are giving you some you know, some doubts, they're giving you some thoughts. So CCI just showing us maybe it's still gonna be the rising because all of the indicators just point in that, you know, showing that. But CCI giving us just, you know, the feelings and the seeing that it's not gonna be, you know, that drastic. So it's gonna be maybe a little bit more flat than we wanted just to be, you know, to have a clear, 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 clear profit. So you may see it. Yep, and CCI gave us that. So green, green, and then orange. And at that point, yes, 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 I was just right on time because even two seconds, even two seconds could actually kill me all day. And the next one, it's gonna be an upward trend. This is what I see, this is what I've gotta make bad for. And we are at the bottom. And MACD showed it as that. But look at this CCI. I wouldn't say that the CCI, the indicator that actually showing us location of this chart, you know, and on on its own space. No, CCI is a little bit, a little bit, you know, how to say that, it's a little bit individual. It's a little bit indicator that actually are not dependent on that chart. I mean, the position of it. And let's see it again and again. What about the downturn channel? So the first assumption, my was, and that's why I actually made this bad, that we are at the bottom and we're gonna rise. Maybe slowly, but we're still gonna rise because look at all of these candles that were before. Actually, they're a changing and switching and that's a little bit, a little bit tricky. And look at this CCI. I would say that CCI is showing us we gotta get upward and even showing us in some points that it may be some drastic. So, I mean, when it's drastic so for the short period, it is actually the big, you know, the big, big movement. So here we are. And the MACD was still showing all that clear, that it was all fine, but that's, you know, how far it gonna be. Actually, is better, better to read by the CCI. And this is the last one for today. Look at that. Actually, here is no clear signs that we are at the bigger or the bottom. We kind of at the middle level, but we may see some waves. We detect that and we expect it's going to be the same way because look at the dungeon channel, look at the, all of the indicators. Here is some, not, not a clear signal that it's going to rise or it's going to fall that drastically, but some signals that we may have it as a period. And firstly, CCI is kind of flat. So the tendency that we are having is gonna be on the same level. And you may see that we are actually at the same point. Look at the MACD. Yep, there is a clear tendency that we gotta get downward, we gotta get, we gotta get. But still, how actually, how actually not fast is going on. So this closure is so, so, it is weird the word. This closure is so, so slow, yes. But anyway, so look at the downtrend channel. At the point, yeah, it's just all correct and right. It started to be narrow and look at that. It, it's narrow, narrow, but that we just rised. And look at it, CCI, just such a big break in. Somehow it's kind of a little bit hard to predict. Look at the MACD and the CCI. We just lucky we actually entered before that happens, that the market, that this is just the right point when the actually market is playing you and you may think I am the pro trader, but that happens just the, I don't know, a second or two seconds before the closure. You're dead, guys, you are just dead. So guys, we just finished that was actually, you don't know, a catfish because everything is clear. The strategy is quite correct and not only to detect what's going on, but even to see how it's gonna be in a minute. And thanks for the CCI right here. I would say, and I would recommend it, MACD and CCI, of course, that's the kind of perfect combo. And Dungeon Channel here, it's actually giving us more info about the chart because you are checking the chart and with the Dungeon Channel or any types of that indicator that is right on chart, it giving you just, you know, the double checking for that. So know the difference. Know the difference between an MACD and CCI. MACD will show you that we gonna get upward, but we still couldn't be reading out of that indicator how fast it be or how flat, you know, yeah, how, 
cortical in vain. So the CCI uh, is useful in that case. So we just done, we finished. Please be aware of all fake accounts that I'm actually having. Uh, I mean, <laughs> that actually fake accounts, my photos, I mean. And please do not reply to them. I don't have any WhatsApp and you just may check all the links below this video or in my bio, that's the real one. And please just trust only them. Thank you.